Hello YTPC Dublin Pipe here. Uh, belated happy Halloween. Smoking my Peterson with uh, what the tobacco in it. <laughs> Can't remember what it is. Regular blend. Bit of a brain fart there. Sorry about that. Oh, thank you, son. Welcome, father. There you go, there's a son, there's my son. Bye, Dad. Oh, great. So, I was down in Wexford and uh, had a wonderful time. I just came back last night. Spent a few days down there. Very interesting and productive time. I had a lot of uh, very, very nice Guinness in Aloyas and Fetter on Sea. Not a lot, but enough. So, back to the tamper. See? Great tamper. So, uh, the first night I posted the other video and the second night I went back up and I had a, another couple of points and I asked around what was the name of the boat uh, that the, the the nail came from and I found out the name it was the Lady Anne. Um, so I'm going to look up some information out on back with the internet. On it. I knew I'd find it. So on uh, on the Monday there's a bank on bank holiday Monday down there there's a uh, car boot sale. So I went to it. Now normally I've been there umpteen times that I couldn't get anything. But this time, interesting, very very strange. We're there for a meal with with my family. And in one of the pubs, it had Bulwark, B-U-L-W-A-R-K, picture on the wall. And I go, geez, that's tobacco, I never heard of that. So I took a photograph, of, and I said, I might, you know, be interested in having a look, look at it. But um, when I went to the car boot sale, having a look around, what did I find? Very old tin of it. That's course it's empty. And it's a bit grubby and all that, but I clean it up. Gonna go my collection of uh, old tobacco boxes. I've got enough pipes. I'm not buying any more pipes. We have one more and they're not sure. So I'm delighted with that. I'm gonna gonna clean that up. And what else did I get? Very nice gentleman. Pardon me for a minute. A very nice gentleman had some pipes. Now they're in bits, they're cracked and everything else. No, you're okay. But I picked this up, I had to. Uh Bringham, is it? B R I G H A M Brigham pipe. I believe it's a Canadian pipe in the box. This is a four four dot. It's in good condition. Uh, one time you long to fix that up, and uh, I was looking looking it up. Very interesting, you know the stinger on it. Is I think it's a piece of maple. Never seen one. Never seen it. Never have. Um. Very nice looking pipe. Very light pipe. So I'm delighted with that. Wasn't an awful lot of money. So I'll fix that up when I get around to it. A couple more to do. So that's another great purchase. And again, caribou sale. Not expensive. What else did I get? And on another stall, uh, there was a 
darts and I love playing darts and there was a great set of darts I said just will get them and beside it there was this darts are great by the way um, and I got this it's in perfect condition condition it is a uh, bu -bu -bu. Mco, I M C O. Triple X, super. It's a six seven zero zero, made in Austria. Um. So, the chap wanted a tenner, and I was going. Off. So I don't even know if it works or not, you know. And he said it's a, it does work, and I said, so well, okay, so I'll give you fiver. So I got a, got this for a fiver. So I was delighted. Never see, never. I think I remember when years ago my dad used to have, but um, I haven't seen one recently. So I went down for a few points. I had a game of darts with my brother-in-law. Really nice guy. Um, so I, I, on the way to the pub, I bought some fuel, filled it up, and it worked straight away. You know, I had flint in it and all, and he seen it. He went, "You enjoyed one those years ago." Uh, and I was talking to another guy who was out having a pipe and he said he had a few of them as well years ago but uh, it's very rare you see one nowadays so I'm delighted with it it's a great old it's a great pipe lighter again pull out the bottom take this off simple I think this era is about 19, 1970 to 1979, this particular one was made. You just fill it up there with your fluid. Um, I won't go into all the intricacies. But uh, it works a treat. Just fill it up. There's another section in here you put your flint, just push it in and there's a spring load. And it, um, it works a dream. A dream. Look. Oh, happy day. So I have a couple of Zippos. Uh, and now I have one of these. And for five euros. Happy day. So that's all I bought this weekend. Had a really nice time at Wexford. Earl Grey tea, happy days. So I'm back home. And eventually I got some Carnuba wax. I hope it's Carnuba wax. So I'm looking forward to um, polishing up a few of my pipes. Happy head. I'll have to figure out how to do it by hand because I have no machines. I have a Dremel but there's only a sort of a really coarse sandy attachment. That's all I have. Seven C's regular blend is really nice. You only had a bit of it down there. I had most of the ones that I had in Wexford were ladder keys that you don't go with Guinness the world. And I couldn't buy any in the shop because you don't have any. Had a great time. Hope you all had a fantastic Halloween. Um about it and we'll see you on the next one. Slant from Dublin, Ireland.